You come a little bit closer, there you go. S people, welcome to Offscript in association with Jim Pro, and today we're joined by the main man, the, the man that's made it happen, Daily for Ron really. <laughs> yes, So tonight you have showed your ability as a coach and showed the transformation you can make as a fighter. Now talk to me about that win. How did it feel seeing Kenny put on a display like that? Well, I keep telling people, you know, boxing's a process and even though he's an influencer boxing, I told everyone from the start, you can die in this sport, so I want to do everything properly. And, um, yeah, we've had a couple of setbacks along the way, but we always stay true to who we are and um, being respectful to my sport that I've been in my whole life um, and do things the right way, teach the, the sweet science. Um, it's influencer boxing. Um, the plan always with all my fighters, even my pro fighters, is to box with intelligence, but have bad intentions behind it. So if you see the opening, we take them out. Um, yeah, and I think you saw that today, knocked down. Um, I said before, um, on I think it was All Access from Wade, I said, um, you know, how we knock someone out in sparring with a left hook. Um, he got a dartboard of Winderson through it, and it landed on his temple where the left hook will land. And, um, you know, you keep working on your craft every day. You keep practicing and taking it seriously with repetition and repetition. And then that's what you're going to see, like performance like that tonight. I was going to say, talking about that sweet science, it was beautiful how Kenny stepped into range, guard up and then hit with the left hook. Is that something you drilled into him in camp or is that it, something that he just picked up? No, it, there's no mistake. We drill fight situations and it's fight specific. They get in the ring to fight at the end of the day. Um, so you need to learn all areas uh, of the sport that includes moving in on the inside like in different ways, not always the same way, finding different ways to, you know, um, uh, give yourself an advantage in there, you know, and understanding of the game as well, which showed tonight. What I was impressed with is that the last round, even though it was the last round, he took it up five levels and start, start, yeah, Winderson is a come forward fighter. Mm -hmm. he, he was beating Winderson at his own game when it came to being toe to toe. Absolutely, you know? I saw. And that's what it was all about, it was about controlling the distance, beating him up with the jab, with straight shots behind it, put, uh, hooks, manipulations, uppercuts, body shots. And then when the time's right, if Winderson gets there and he wants to go toe to toe, it's making sure that if Winderson starts it, we always finish and have the answers. Absolutely. Now, I can't say I'm proud enough of Kenny tonight. He showed what his worth is. Now, obviously, this is tournament boxing. We had another scrap tonight. We're going to see Anis on Gibb in the finals. Now, what do you make of that fight? And what did you make of Gibb's level? I saw you iron him up during open workout. Obviously, tonight is fight. What did you make of it? I didn't see it. You didn't no. see the we fight didn't have no all. TV. We didn't want to see the show. We, we had one one name that was focused on and that's Winderson. Winderson. Yeah, so we didn't, I, I haven't seen any fight. I haven't seen any fight, I know the results, yeah. um, but I haven't seen any fight. Um, but again, Gib, to me is gonna be another display of um, dominance um, against Gib. Um, I, I wanted Gib in the final, you know? Um, and respect for Lee as well with Leon, it's which a weird situation to be in because we're teammates with Deji and now we're going up against each other in the final. So, um, yeah, uh, good luck to him. I was going to say, touching base on that chess match with Leon, how do you feel like it will be going against your friend in there? Is that, is that, does that bring anything else into it? Or um, no, it because uh, it's about the fighters, not about me and Leon. Okay. And I shouldn't make it about myself and Leon shouldn't make it about himself. Okay. You know, we've got a job to do as coaches to prepare them, give a game plan and then it's up to the fighters to, you know, um, put it into action. So it's not about me and Leon, it's, it's, it's their moment, it's their time. I couldn't agree more. Now, I will speak up a little bit about last time we spoke about Deji and you said he looked a bit a little a bit rusty, but you wanted him back in the gym. Now, can we expect him back in the gym, in the ring soon, and seeing some of your other fighters come in the ring soon as well? Yeah, of course, when the time's right, you know. You see, with, with Deji, you know, uh, like uh, regarding opponents and everything like that, I just let it be. I'm there to tra train people. Maybe a when they, when they, when they, when, <laughs> you never know. It could be Manny Pacquiao, you don't know. You don't know with him, you know, so. It's, it's hard to talk about names because I never thought we'd fight Floyd Mayweather. Yeah, you know what I, mean? I agree. So it's just about him, again, just staying in the gym, learning, 
um, working on his craft so he can show levels, more, uh, up the levels in the, the next fight. Absolutely. Now I wanted to get your thoughts on a certain somebody. KSI, he's been talking a lot of smack yeah, on this so tournament. So I want to know, what are your opinions on that? And is it valid that he's talking all this, all this was? He's going to do King that because he's got, he's, he's got a rival, mm. you know, uh, promotion. You know what I mean? So, he, he, of course, he's, it's only natural that he's going to want one, that to fail. Uh, so, misfits shine. So, that's, to me, that's a normal. That's n not a bad thing, what he's doing. You know, at the end of the day, just like boxers do. If you say you're the best, you're going to tell everyone you're the best. You know what I mean? Um, so, he's, he's, you know, it's fine for me. I mean, you say that, Morgan, but I did just see a tweet from KSI saying that Kenny displayed the best performance tonight. I think I've been seeing that all throughout Twitter. Now, what do you make if they do potentially fight? KSI was calling out Winderson, but I think that fight is no longer. I think Kenny has displayed that he is levels above Winderson. Now, what do you make of that fight? Obviously, we've seen some sparring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you know what? For me, I just take it fight by fight, you know. Like, I've n everyone's been asking me, who do you want in the tournament, you know, <laughs> when we've been going through this. Through this. It's, it's not really a thing I make. A, I don't make a point of, like, who we want, you know. I don't waste my time with studying influencer boxers either, mm. you know. I know who they are. I've seen clips, but I don't sit there studying influencer boxers in until Kenny or Deji has to fight one of them um, and then I let my brain work you know what I mean so yeah it's, uh, if um, KSI is ahead of the game when it comes to you know people he wants to fight which is obviously Tommy Fury Jake Paul so I don't think he, he would fight Kenny just yet unless there was a need for an opponent Mm. You know what I mean to get the to get the Very spices. Going. Drop out or something. Yeah, I mean, but yeah, it's cool. We across that bridge if ever it comes to the summer. Now you're wearing that strapping yellow T-shirt. Beta Squad is on your chest. Now, what does it mean for Kenny to have his friends, his family in the audience supporting him all the way in Dublin? Um, yeah, it's it's good. That's what we that's what we do. Um, thank thank you for the support. Um, we're like family, so. Mm. Could, you, could we see you training any other Beta Squad members or? Um, <laughs> who knows, man? I'm just going to enjoy it tonight. Okay, okay. Well, you know, it's this time. I know everyone's heading off. I want to give you the mic, and it's your time to talk to the people and enjoy it. Nothing much to say, just believe in yourself, and that's it. If you believe in yourself, and then magic happens. That's it. Thank you so much, Daily. I really appreciate your time as always. Thank you very much, and congratulations.